Welcome to Davis Sports Report, where we are continuing our coverage of the Paris Olympics. Please remember to turn on notifications so you can be notified right away when we drop new content. The competition for the women's 100-meter hurdle was filled with drama, surprise, and heartbreak, leaving one athlete balled up on the track crying. This was the heartbreak seen around the world. You don't want to miss it. Let's start at the beginning. The field was wide open. There were 40 women from around the world that qualified for the Olympics 100 meter hurdles competition, but only one could win the gold. Having three athletes, each are United States, Jamaica, Bahamas, and Australia. Having two athletes each are Japan, China, Netherlands, France, Canada, Finland, and Hungary. All other countries represented have one hurdler each, including Puerto Rico, who has the Tokyo Olympic gold medal champion, Jasmine Camacho Quinn. The University of Kentucky alum, who also holds the Olympic record with a time of 12.26 seconds. Also in the mix is the world record holder, Toby Anison from Nigeria, with a shocking time of 12.12 .12 seconds. We've got a lot of hard hitters competing for the gold. Now let's get into the races. In the first round, there are five heats, and the top three of each heat move on to the next round. Additionally, three more will automatically advance based on their time recorded. All others that actually finish the race will go to the repejage round for a chance to redeem themselves and head into the semifinals. Let's look at the heats to see who will advance. First heat qualifiers are world record holder Toby Amason from Nigeria, Alicia Johnson of the United States, and Janique Brown of Jamaica. Second heat qualifiers are Tokyo gold medalist Jasmine Camacho Quinn, Cindy Simber, who's the Great Britain's national record holder and attended University of Michigan, and lastly was Pia Skorzowski of Poland. In the third heat, qualifiers are Masai Russell from the United States, who had the fastest time at the U.S. Olympic trials with a personal best of 12.25 seconds. Also, Nadine Vasser from Netherlands, who tied Masai's time of 12.53 in this round, and Sirena Samba Maiela coming in right behind them. The animated Australia Michelle Jenike started out great, but went down hard after the third hurdle. She will be able to make up for it in the repejage round as she did pick herself up and finish the race. Fourth heat qualifiers are two-time world champion Danielle Williams from Jamaica, Sarah Levin from Ireland, and Dataji Kambucha from Switzerland. Yvonne Mato from Venezuela was disqualified as she pushed the hurdle down with her hands and did not complete the race. And in the fifth heat qualifiers are Akira Nugent from Jamaica, Bahamas' favorite hurdler, Devin Charlton, and the University of Florida student, Grace Stark from the United States. Charisma Taylor from Jamaica, Mako Fukibi from Japan, and Miriam Abdul Rashid from Canada will qualify based on their time and will not have to compete in the repejage round. Let's head over to the repejage round to see who will advance. Repejage round. Repejage round has three heats, and the top two of each heat will move forward. That means there will be six moving forward. Advancing from the repejage round were Heat 1, Marion Forey from South Africa with an easy win, placing a time of 12.79. And Mayeka Tijin Alim from Netherlands. Heat 2. 
are Ebony Morrison from Liberia and Vanessa Cicado Maribel from Ecuador, winning narrowly over Rita Hurst of Finland by a small fraction of a second. And Heat 3 is Lada Harella from Finland and Yumi Tanaka from Japan. I'm hopeful that everyone is trying to reserve their energy for the big race because the best time in the repage round was 12.79. And 12.79 isn't going to cut it against the world record holder. The road has ended for Venezuela, India, Haiti, Madagascar, Slovakia, Hungary, China, and the fun girl of the hurdles, Michelle Janike from Australia. We will miss your bouncy personality and best of luck next Olympics. Semifinals. In the semifinals round, there were three heats. The best two qualify for the finals, plus two will qualify based on their time, totaling eight that will compete in the final round. First heat. Advancing is Grace Stark of the United States with an impressive time of 12.39 and Devin Charlton of the Bahamas, knocking out world record holder Toby Amason from Nigeria. And this is where the heartbreak begins, as Liberia's last hope at a medal was crushed as Ebony Morrison went down during the competition in the first heat. Second heat moving forward would be Alicia Johnson from the United States who attended both the University of Oregon and Texas Tech, coming in with an even more impressive time than Stark of 12.34. Also advancing is Nadine Visser from Netherlands who not only competes in the hurdles but also the 4x100 relay. And in the third and final heat, we had another brutal fall, this time Cindy Simber from Great Britain, shattering her dreams of winning a medal. When attending University of Michigan, Cindy broke several records, but sadly, she won't be able to add an Olympic medal to her accomplishments just yet. Moving forward in heat three are the Olympic record holder, Jasmine Camacho Quinn from Puerto Rico, with a season best time of 12.35 seconds, and Messiah Russell from the United States, who attended the same high school as 16-year-old Phenom Quincy Wilson, Bullet School in Potomac, Maryland, and she is a recent graduate of University of Kentucky and holds the best record for 2024 at a time of 12.35. Qualifying based on time were Akira Nugent from Jamaica with a time of 12.44 and Serena Samba Mayela of France, narrowly making it in with a time of 12.52. And this race is starting to heat up as we now have three hurdlers with a time in the semifinals under 12.4. Finals. The stage is now set to determine who the fastest hurdler in the world is. Let the race begin. Right off the bat, Akira Nugent nips the first hurdle, slowing her down. On the second hurdle, it's nipped by Messiah Russell, but it didn't slow her down by much. Third hurdle was taken down by Elisa Johnson, making her lose her balance and putting her behind the pack. By the first hurdle, you can clearly see the front runners to be Serena Samba Bayela, who qualified based on time from France and the returning champion, Jasmine Camacho Quinn from Puerto Rico. By hurdle five, Nadine Vassar from Finland is joining the leader pack. By the ninth hurdle, Masai Russell from the United States is making a move and looks to be neck and neck with Camacho Quinn, while Samba, Mayela, and Vassar now lead the pack. Jamaica's Akira Nugent appears to have dropped from the race at this point. As they cleared the 10th and final hurdle, Russell has now easily taken over the number two spot, chasing down Camacho Quinn and Vassar, but Samba Mayela still leads the pack. You could see all the runners giving it all they had and leaning into the finish line. As these Olympics have proven, the competition is steep and the results come down to a tenth of a millisecond and the wait begins. It has come down to a photo finish and after review, the decision was made that Messiah Russell from the United States held the victor. This was a heartbreaking ending for Serena Samba Mayela as she fell to the ground in tears, unable to contain her emotions as she writhed in emotional pain as the world looked on.
These Olympic Games have been filled with athletes dreaming big that their hard work would result in a gold medal. And when it's so close that you can taste it as you cross the finish line, just to be told that it was a portion of a second too slow is enough to crush anyone's soul. The silver goes to Serena Samba Maella from France, and the bronze goes to Jasmine Camacho Quinn from Puerto Rico. We want to congratulate Messiah Russell on doing what seemed almost impossible, holding no world records and winning a gold medal in her very first Olympic game. Ring that bell, Messiah. It must feel so sweet to have a Cinderella story like this. As always, thank you for joining us. Please like, comment, and subscribe. We will see you on the next one. Have a good one.